how do you feel? hi guys welcome back to our channel so today i have sad news i would say i mean it's not good news it's not bad news but it's just a little bit scary i guess As you guys all know, we are vloggers and that means that we have to share the good things but we also have to share the bad things because that is just reality, that is life. Um, life is not just always good. Some things are gonna happen but we will come out of it 10 times stronger. But I just wanted to share it with you guys. So basically, um, I've been dealing with this for, I think, about a year, a year and a half. Um, a few of you have noticed that I have a lump right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, probably. So I have a lump on my thyroid and on my thyroid. I don't know how you say it, thyroid, thyroid, whatever it is. I have a lump in my neck, basically. And I got it checked out about a year and a half ago and what the doctor said is that it might be nothing so I would have to wait six months and see if it's still there after six months I would have to come back. And um, so I went home not thinking about it. It has been there a long time so I didn't even notice it until um, we started vlogging again after I had Skype and someone sent me a DM saying that um, I think it was their sister or their cousin or their friend also had it and that I should get it checked out again. And so I talked to her and I was like, yeah, you're right. I have to get it checked out again. So I think about then it had been like a year before the last time that I went to the doctor. So I went again and a coincidence that day, my doctor wasn't there, someone else was there and they said the same thing, come back in six months. And I was like, that is what my doctor already told me and it's been more than six months. And he was like, oh, oh well, that is not good. And so the first thing they do because it's your um, thyroid, usually it makes um, hormones for your it produces hormones for your body I don't know exactly what type of hormones but um, you can feel tired if your hormones are not good you can gain weight you can lose weight it's just a lot of things that could happen um, and then I didn't have any symptoms or I didn't know if I had it or not because I was tired because Sky was waking up every three hours. I just had a baby. And so I didn't notice that I was tired because if it was because of Sky or because of the thyroid, I didn't know. I just automatically thought it was because of Sky. And so the first thing I had to do was they had to check my blood to make sure that my hormone levels were okay. That came out good. My hormones were okay. So the next step was to get an ultrasound. I did that and then when I did that, the doctors were like, um, it looks like you have a cyst of something or something and just to make sure that it is a cyst or um, 
or if it's something else, we have to send you to the hospital so they can um, do a bio biopsy. And so I went to the hospital, got the biopsy. The first time it came out like right in the middle. So there's level one to five and then mine came out in three. So it's not good, but it's also not bad. It's right in the middle. So they didn't know exactly what to do because usually they say that um, it's not an easy surgery. So they would rather not operate, not do the surgery. And so he was like, you know, to make sure we're gonna do the biopsy again in six weeks. Um, I went and I did the biopsy for a second time. The biopsy came back inconclusive. So basically there were no results. So I had to go back a third time. And let me tell you guys how the biopsy goes because it might sound easy, but it is not fun. So they take a fine needle, they do ultrasound, they take a fine needle and they stick it right into the nodule. So in your, you have like a needle poking in your neck. Once the needle is in, they have to like, like look around and try to find the nodule. When they have it, they puncture it, they take something out and then they send it to the lab. So I had to do that three times. The third time, it came back level four. So that means it is not, it's probably not a good thing to keep. And to make sure that it is good or bad, so if they wanna know 100% sure, they have to do the surgery. And because, of the, because the nodule is only on one side, they will only take out half of my thyroid. That means I will be left with the other one and hopefully it will produce enough hormones for my body if it doesn't then i have to take medicine my entire life let's hope we don't get there but anyways um because it came back level four that means i have to have surgery i have to remove it and that is what gonna what's gonna happen tomorrow i have so much anxiety so i already have anxiety on my own so having a surgery i've never had to been in a had to be in a hospital i never slept in a hospital i never had to have surgery i never broke anything i just i have always been healthy and so this is just not an easy thing i want to cry all day long but just i have kids i can't and this is gonna be the longest time that I haven't been with Skye. I've, she's never slept somewhere else. I've never slept without her. So it's gonna be hard, but I know it is something that I have to do to be healthy for my kids and make sure I can raise them and we can be a happy family. So I just have to do this, but we got this. I'm very sure we got this. So tonight, I'm just gonna sleep early. Right now it's, I think, nine o'clock. And I have to be at the hospital at 6 a.m. I already got my hospital bag ready. Um, one thing that I wanted to do, I wanted to do that with you guys, is get my Netflix account set up because I'm probably gonna be bored. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to talk immediately, um so yeah as you guys know we have cash on lap which means i can really easily get my netflix started so i will do this with you guys so you guys can see how easy it is and you guys can also do it if you want your cash cash on web easy go to the website cash on web um make an account Go to Pagadero, put money on it, and get your Netflix. Not hard. You don't need a credit card. You don't need anything. No long rows at the bank. Really easy. Anyways, just do what you usually do to pay your Netflix. And then you go to your cash on web. You make sure you have money on it. You send an SMS to, to your phone so you can get, you can unlock your card. And put 
the information in your Netflix and done guys. It is that easy. I think this took me about three minutes. I'm not joking. This took me, I think less than three minutes. I think I'm ready to go guys. First I'm gonna cry a little and then we're gonna go. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. How do you feel? Amazing. Still in pain? Mm. My incision hurts. The what hurt? Incision. Oh. And I have a dream for the blood coming down. This was asking, where's mama? Where's mama? Where's mama? I want to eat pizza. You want to eat pizza? Yes. All pizza, all by myself. I'm not sharing. You can't eat pizza, Lene. I know. But I want it. No. You're supposed to say yes. No, right now we have, yeah. But I think better buy like ice cream for you or. No ice cream, no pizza. You can't eat pizza. If you want, I can go buy pizza for you if you want. This is the this is the palo de vida, the pal of the bit. No, it's not. It's called an IV. What's it? IV. IV? What's IV? Yeah. yeah, but I think in class how do you call it palo de vida? No, they don't. In papi in English, pal of the bit. No, they don't. Turkan in English. Are you saying English? IV. IV. Okay, this is IV in Curaçao, palo de vida. And, Are you sure? Are you just talking? And the stupid? combination is pal of the bed. Palo de bed, the pal of the bed. Hey, you're all red. Everything is red. Mm -hmm. What's that? They had to clean my face with something and then it stayed red. It hurts to swallow. You can't swallow? I can, but it hurts. You still ugly, but don't you worry. I still love you. You still like it. Mm -hmm. You like my ugliness. Don't you worry. Yeah, you can there. Hey, when your hair was open, you was looking like the, the man on the dollar. You know the man on the dollar? <laughs> At least that man is rich, are you? <laughs> yeah, but soon I'm gonna be rich. Don't you worry. Soon. Soon we're gonna be rich. I like your food. Okay, something else. Can you grab me my charger and my earpods? Where? In my bag. Where? Say bye to your friends. <coughs> yeah, I love you guys. Love you guys. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. <laughs>